Hi, it's Ainsley from Clarity. Welcome to our second video, which is introducing your clients to Clarity. And this is going to be an example of the type of video that you can send out to your clients. Now, hopefully you've seen the first video, which is actually a webinar, and it's taken you through the entire video system, why video, what video to use, the types of things you need to consider, the preparation that you need to do in advance of the, the, the meeting, and the topics that we're going to be covering during the video. So if you haven't seen that, then I'd encourage you to have a look at that first, or at least have a review of the slides that we've prepared from that uh, video so that it gives you a feel and flavor for what we're recording. So this is just gonna be a, a quick recording of a video to send out to the client, taking them through uh, the draft accounts um, and introducing them to cli Clarity. Now it's assumed that we've dealt with most of the queries on the draft accounts at this point. It's assumed that we've loaded the clients on Clarity. We're happy with, with, with that. It's assumed that we've also looked at the seven key numbers and that they tell and match the story that we're telling in the accounts and we understand the main issues and highlights uh, and, and the stories actually uh, make sense to us. And that we've also moved the parameters um, on the, the levers button, we've gone to the future screen, we've moved the parameters, and we've done that anywhere between one or 5% is, is a good guide to go. Um, I particularly ha I'm happy and comfortable to use 5%. I think it's an easy number to explain to people. Of course, 1% is as well, because everybody should be able to do 1%. So I will leave that up to you. I've moved the lever by 5%. So I've uh, loaded my draft accounts. I've had to do it manually, actually, because uh, I've created a fictitious client. So I didn't have the API to be able to hook it into uh, QuickBooks or Zero. So I have put the, the, the enter the data manually. And that was actually a really quick process. It took probably 10 to 15 minutes tops. Now, if you are using the API and you are using your data from Zero QuickBooks, you will need to put in the adjustments in the draft accounts into your QuickBooks and Zero data before you start to use the clarity and talk to the client. We want to make sure those numbers match. So it's good practice to do so anyway, but you will need to have made sure that you've put in those opening balance adjustments and that the accounts in clarity match the actual draft accounts that you're going to go. So I've assumed also that you've got an idea of the points that you want to cover, that the, the, the issues that you want to raise in the accounts or the points you want to highlight. Particularly, you probably want to mention some of the key numbers in those in the PL. You probably want to highlight the tax position. And again, if there are some concerns or issues you want to raise, then uh, please do so now rather than raise them at the, the, uh, the, the client account meeting. So for example, if there's points that have been too sensitive for the team to deal with and they felt it's more appropriate that you're dealing with those points, then again, start to introduce those in advance. I don't want you uh, creating any um, disruption for the client or getting them to think, oh my goodness, um, I wasn't expecting that. So we certainly want to, to, to highlight those. But the primary part and the primary reason for this video is to get the clients excited about coming into a meeting about the business, about the potential profit improvement within the business, the cash improvement within the business, and how you're going to work with them to help them be able to actually uh, achieve those, those increases and those improvements. So again, this isn't Hollywood production. So we've talked about that. This is a quick way to get across a lot of information. It's also a good way to introduce a new uh, service line or a new discussion with a client in a really interesting way, break through the noise, cut through the usual routine, and actually get them excited about booking a meeting with you because that's what this is all about. So uh, let's get started. Um, I'm using Zoom, so whatever system you're using, if you just wanna make sure that your screen's all set up to be able to do that, um, I'm ready to go, so let's shoot. Again, this isn't about making it perfect. There will be issues and errors sometimes. I don't want you re-recording this all the time. This is about you being authentic and real and actually getting through this quickly and getting a lot of information across in a quick manner and making the client excited about coming in to see you. So don't worry about it. If you make mistakes, that's good to go, um, as long as they're obviously not horrendous mistakes. Um, let's, let's use this as a really exciting way to, to get the client excited and fired up about their business. So let's get started. Hi Mary, it's Ainsley from Clarity. I know the team have been discussing uh, various issues and queries they've been having with the accounts as we've been going on, along over the last uh, couple of weeks. Um, I just wanted to let you know that we're about to send the draft accounts out to you um, and I wanted to, to talk to you about some of those uh, big headline numbers in those draft accounts. But more importantly, Mary, we've crunched some of your numbers and I think there's a potentially a big uh, profit improvement 
inherent within the business. We'd love to, to, to arrange a meeting to actually talk through those. Um, and I wanted to, to, to talk to you about that today. So let's, let's get started. I'm just gonna share my screen and show you where we are with the draft accounts. So if you just bear with me whilst I do that. Great, so um, the draft accounts that we're sending out, you should get those in the post uh, tomorrow. We're sending them out this evening. Obviously, if you don't get them, <laughs> and you've had this, then please get in touch with us and we'll make sure we get another set sent out to you. Now, the turnover obviously as expected has increased from 2.2 million up to 4.1. I know you've been in discussions with the team um, and that is in line with your expectations. Now that's obviously uh, uh, good for all the hard work that you've been putting into the company. It's actually an 86% increase in, um, in, in turnover, which is whopping. I think that's probably one of the biggest for our clients. So, so well done you amazing work and obviously a, a good reward for all the effort that you put in. Now we've also looked at the um, gross profit uh, number and that's obviously increased from 720 up to 960. And actually that number is showing at 23%, so the margin is 23% uh, this year. It's gone down the percentage margin from the previous year by about nine percentage points. It was about 32, 33% last year. So it would be good to get a feel for why you think that decrease has happened. So let's have a chat about that at the meeting. Now your administrative expenses have increased in line uh, and, and with expectations. And that's showing that overall you've uh, had a, a good return this year. The profitability has gone from 37 up to 133,000. So again, really exciting and, and a good result for all the hard Work that you've been putting in. Obviously, that's generated a tax bill. And this year, we're seeing that uh, based on those draft numbers, that the, the draft tax bill is coming out at 33,000. Now, that bill is payable at the end of September. So I just wanted to highlight that and make sure that if we're going to finalize these accounts as they are, um, then you will need to make sure that you've got 33,000 set aside by the end of September. So a lot of advance notice, but again, sometimes these things get missed. So just want to make sure that that money's set aside. Now, those have been um, a, a good reflection of your activities this year. Um, let's get a meeting in the diary. I'm happy to, to deal with any queries that you've got on those accounts during, during that meeting. And, and clearly, if you've got any issues or concerns that you want to raise, then let's, let's absolutely use that meeting to, to have a chat through and get those accounts finalized. What I really, really wanted to show you though, Mary, was we've been crunching through those numbers. And Based on those draft accounts, we can see, as we've said, that the revenue growth has been at 86%. So again, massive. The gross profit percentage has been at 23%, and that's slightly lower than the previous year. Well, actually 9% lower, and, and hopefully we can have a discussion on that. Your operating profit percentage, so that's uh, you know, your, your, your profit before interest and tax depreciation and amortization, that's, that's on your goodwill. So that's showing at 4.1%. And again, that's up slightly on the prior year. Not as high as we would have hoped uh, with the level of profitability that you've generated. But again, let's chat about that at the meeting and let's more importantly talk about what we can do with that going forward. Revenue per employee has been great. Um, your core cash target is the big thing that we really, really wanna to talk to you about. Your current uh, cash position, uh, uh, or certainly the cash position at the end of the year was two and a half thousand pounds. And based on what we're looking at going forward, you're going to need a little bit of funding here because we see there's a, a gap in what we believe is what you should have in the bank to be able to, to fund overheads and to be easily able to pay all those taxes that are coming due. So let's talk about that. Um, but again, that's something we've highlighted in the past. And again, it continues. It's just the nature of your business. But let's see what we can do from that funding position. Cash days has improved slightly. Um, and uh, we'd like to see how we can make some further improvements on that. And again, your business return is a, is a big improvement this year. A, a return of all the hard work. But again, as I said, we've crunched through those numbers. And, and Mary, I'm delighted to tell you that I think there's potentially, uh, if we can move uh, your main five levers within the business by 5%, then there's a potential profit, massive profit improvement there of 272,000 and a potential improvement to the cash position of, of closer to 300,000. Now, I can't guarantee that we can move all those numbers by 5% or that those numbers will actually be be realized, but those are big numbers. We'd love to talk to you about them. We'd love to talk to you about how you can achieve that. So if you can get back to me with some dates that are good for you, we'd love to get this in the diary straight away. Again, draft accounts out to you. If you've got any queries, give me a shout. Hope to speak to you soon, Mary. Thank you so much. So I hope that's what you, you get a good feel for that. 
very, very simple uh, uh, video, very simple points we want to cover, main numbers in the accounts, and we're going back to the main, uh, the profit uh, position, the tax bill that's due, when it's payable, make sure that that doesn't come as a shock, and then we're talking about the potential profit improvement. Now, if you have not done the draft accounts and you're doing this with the numbers, then you can go straight into clarity. We don't need to mention the numbers. All we need to say is to the client is, I've been looking at your numbers, I've been going through them, and I think there's some really exciting possibilities within the business. We'd love to set up a meeting to discuss those. Let me take you through the headline numbers now. That's just so you can get a feel and flavor for, for, for why we want to see you quickly. So again, if you've got the draft accounts numbers and you want to use that, then fire off the back of that. If you don't and you want to go straight into those numbers, it's an easy way to say, we've been thinking about you, we've crunched your numbers, and we think there's potential big profit improvement that we want to talk to you about. Let's get a meeting in the diary straight away. Hope you're as excited as, as we are. Hope that's helpful and hope that uh, you have happy videos ahead and that this gives you a good uh, a framework to be able to send out videos to your clients, introducing clarity to your clients. Thank you very much. If you've got any queries, obviously get in touch with any member of the team. And if you've got suggestions or improvements, then we'd love to hear from you because again, we'd love to share them with the community. Thank you.